Hi, I'm Tim Haight from CGNet. Since Microsoft acquired Yammer a while back, it has been working to integrate Yammer's collaboration facilities with its other collaboration applications such as SharePoint and OneDrive for Business. This week, they introduced a new feature which is kind of interesting and which I'd like to show you, which is Yammer Conversations. What Yammer Conversations does is integrate Yammer collaboration into Office Online applications that can be accessed from documents either in OneDrive for Business or from SharePoint. We're going to start this voyage of discovery inside a SharePoint site. And this is a demonstration site that we've set up, and it has a documents library. We're going to open a document in this documents library. And as you see, there's this new pane that comes out at the right, which you can close and open again, called Yammer Conversations. And that allows you to make comments about this document right next to the document. And so let's say something here, such as I'm thinking of changing the title to augmented reality. Welcome to the Mind Palace. And I'm going to send this. But if I just hit post, this is going to go to the all users group of my company's Yammer site. So I don't want to do that. What I do instead is I click on the little arrow. It says post to a type of group name. I click in there and I'm going to send it to the video demo group, which I've already set up. It's a private group that has the same people in it that are the folks with whom I've shared this document. And then I'm going to click post. And so now that comment shows up here in the uh, Yammer conversation pane. Now what it also does, let's exit out of this. What it also does is it shows up in Yammer. Now you notice up here I've got Yammer now in the top nav bar of my Office 365 site collections. So I go to Yammer and sure enough, the comment shows up here. And right now I'm in the video demo group. Now if I went to all company, the comment is not there. You see these are different comments. and so. That is a way that you can actually post just to a private group and keep the comments in there. Now, this private group can also put any other kind of material it wants to into the Yammer conversation, just as it can into any Yammer group. It could have comments from several different documents feeding into this area if you were doing collective work. So you not only have the opportunity to comment on a particular document, you have the opportunity to mix and match those with other kinds of things that you're doing. Now, you noticed a little while ago when we were back here at the video demo site and pointed out that Yammer is up here. You may not have that on your site because you may not have made Yammer your default social media service. And you have to do that in order to get this Yammer Conversations feature into your Office applications. The way that you do that is you have to be an administrator. And an administrator has to go to SharePoint Administration. And then once you're in SharePoint administration, you go to settings. And when you're in settings, you will see this enterprise social collaboration section. And over here where it says use the yammer.com service, you'll have to put a dot in that radio button so that it will make Yammer your your default service. Now, if you're using Newsfeed a lot now, you may not want to do this because this will pretty much uh, get rid of Newsfeed. It used to say Newsfeed up here, and now it doesn't. So you might want to learn more and click here and try to figure out the other things that will be involved before you make the change. But if you want to see those new uh, Yammer Conversations panes, you're going to have to make Yammer your default enterprise social collaboration tool within Office 365. Now, another good thing about this is that it works in OneDrive for Business. So if you go to OneDrive for Business and you open up a document in uh, OneDrive for Business, you get the same kind of thing. There's a place here and you can post in the Yammer group here. You could post in the, the private demo group here the same way. And so you can put other documents in there and you can do it as easily out of OneDrive for Business as you do it out of SharePoint. Now, there are a couple of things that aren't 
baked yet in the way they've put this together, and they've been uh, upfront about that. One of them is that you really can't involve external users yet. So this is just for people that are within your domain. Another thing is that it's only available now in the Office Online documents. If you go and try to edit a document in your desktop Word, for example, you won't have a Yammer Conversations pane. All in all, though, this looks like a pretty exciting way to integrate Yammer into uh, document sharing and, and document management, and so I hope this has been helpful. For a lot more information about how to use Office 365 in general, and as also Office 2013, check out the CGNet Office 365 Resource Center at the URL below.